Tell off guys, what? today I'm making a fish pie, okay? Mm -hmm. uh, my cousin and his wife, Gung Leo and Rosita, they dropped off this fish and some other goodies like taro and stuff to feed my mum. So I put away this fish that they gave. It was a big fish, big fish guys. And I stored it in the garage. <laughs> Not the garage, in the freezer guys. Shh, get right. Anyway. So guys, it's just that my freezer is next to the garage, so I was thinking about the garage and then all of a sudden the freezer came in and then I just kept letting it out the garage. Anyway, so last night, or yesterday, I bought it out because it was frozen, right? And then it forwarded it out and then I said to my husband, can you fill it me a piece? Okay, and anyway, I'll show you guys the ingredients. We're going to be needing some thickened cream, a bit of milk, butter, white pepper, mixed herbs, onion powder, parsley, garlic, half an onion, and a creamy seafood. I don't need to put that in, but I thought, I've got the packet here, so I just added it. And then I've got um, a piece of fish there. And Australian prawns have uh, already been uh, shelled and deveined. And some potatoes that I'm going to be mashing up and putting on top of the fish pie. So here's the ingredients, guys. Okay, did you see the ingredients? Okay. That piece of fish had come from that fish that my husband um, fillet um and took off the skin and that so thank you Gong Leo and Rosita for this fish finally getting to use it and make a fish pie from it anyway guys thank you for joining me i hope you guys are all well but first of all i'm going to have to peel the potatoes because the potatoes will be bubbling and i do the the other bits and pieces wait on come on let's go 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 Let's go. Let's go. You guys are not trying to run away from peeling potatoes, okay? Oh, I remember as a child, you know, when it was time for peeling potatoes. My brothers and I, we used to try and hide because we didn't like peeling the potatoes. But if you don't listen to Mama Bear, she will fussy you. So it's either you go and peel the potatoes or you get a fussy. My brothers, they'll go and peel it. Me, I'll go outside and play. So I'm just going to wash these potatoes. Now don't forget to salt your potatoes, guys. And now it's time to chop up these, um, the fish and the prawns, okay? I told Elvis to make sure that there's no bone and I can straight away feel a little bone. So not to try and get cut. You can feel a bone when you run your your finger along your fingers along the thing. The fish? Yeah, and I can't feel any more, so lucky. Only one. One they got away they say. Yeah, fish don't take long to cook, guys. So, when I'm done with my white sauce, I'm just going to chuck it in, into the pot, and turn the sauce off. And there will be enough heat to cook this, like, feeling good. Okay? And then, even if it's half cooked, when it's inside the, the roasting dish, it will cook thoroughly. Right through. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Hey, 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 hey! 
I just felt a little bone. Dear. Get out of there. Suss up. Mm. Anyway, okay. These are semi frozen, like, they were frozen, guys. So I'm just going to half these prawns because they will shrink down. And I'm putting them together with the fish because I want to give them a, a little shower. And, oh, let's see, that's why you got to clean them because they, you know, slip and slide everywhere. Mm -hmm. So just halving them, putting them together. And then I'm going to make the white sauce after I cut all this. I just want to clean all this and get it all ready for when I do make the sauce and then I'll just chuck it in. Anyway, thank you to those that uh, come along to tune in and, and hang out with me while I do this. So I'm going to add all these prawns. Okay, so it's going to be more like a, a prawn fish pie. So Laura, I don't know what, what's happening with her um, channel, guys. You know, my daughter has been saying that she's going to have a channel, channel, channel. I don't know. But my daughter, she's a bit of a, um, I don't know, she's a bit weird, that girl. She's, she's like me. We're, we're loving, but there's some weirdo ways about us. <laughs> Who said that? Was it you? Nah. We just like to say what we want to say and you know, do what we want to do. Not to be offensive to anyone. No, guys. It's just that like, I muck around too much and I say the things that I say, but it's not to harm anyone. No, it's just to have fun. Anyway, so I'm going to give these a, a bath, <laughs> a shower. I'm going to give these a shower, guys. And then I'm going to be making a white sauce. Do you know, guys, I always forget something to add into my recipe, eh? You have to use a uh, plain flour, guys, because you have to make a, a roux. Guys, I'm going to put in this butter, this bit of butter, okay? So I'll quickly half that, and then drop it into there. Then I'm going to um, chuck in this onion, just to let it mingle, mingle. I'm going to be making a thick sauce, guys. You know why? Because when the water of the prawns and the fish come out, it sort of makes it runny. So you're going to make it a bit thicker. So when it does that, it's going to meet together and, you know, it's going to be just the right thickness. Now I'm going to be putting in here is two, two flour. Okay. And I'm also going to put in this creamy, hey, 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 stop it. Yeah, the creamy seafood powder. Then I'm going to mix this together. Oi, oi, oi. Rough and tough this. Then you want to add in the cream. Okay. So, and then I want to add in a bit of milk. like running is not thick yet so add in a teaspoon of garlic I always go overboard with my heat and onion powder put in some onion powder 
put in some mixed herbs, guys. Mixed herbs. Shake that in there. Shake it in real good so you can taste the flavor of the mixed herbs. Mm -hmm. And you stir it in quick. So that's the thickness that you want it, guys? Bye. Yeah, it's really thick. So I'm gonna give it a taste. Mm-hmm. Needs a bit of salt. Mm-hmm. Before turning it off, you want to put in the fish and all the prawns. Okay. Guys, you don't need to have it on anymore. They look thick, doesn't it? I'm going to be pouring that all into here. So, it's just going to fall in. Ta da! Looks like plastic. I'm going to be putting um, some broccoli in here. This broccoli is a broccoli bake. Okay, so I'll drop one, two, three, four. So it's like a lucky dip. So when you get a broccoli, yay! And if you don't, oh well, sorry. So the potatoes, uh, the potatoes are cooked now, guys. So it's just a matter of mashing it. Get these pieces of butter and put it in there. Yeah, just two pieces, guys. Two big pieces because, guys, the butter will make it so. And then you add in the cream extra. And then you're going to put in some cream. You just want to put enough cream in just to soften it. You know, just to keep it like creamy. And then you have to taste it and see if it's got enough salt. I did put some salt in here, but I don't know how good it is. Okay. Mm. Okay. Okay. So you start putting the potato on top. Okay. Sometimes when I make a fish pie, I add eggs, boiled eggs. Sometimes I don't. Now, I think there should be enough potato to put the top. Excuse you, can you go over there now? <laughs> You're not wanted. <laughs> You know what guys, just a little bit more over here because I can see the top of the broccoli so you don't want that. Yeah, it looks evenly layered out. Now if you want to be fancy smanchy with your, your fish pie guys, you get yourself a fork. And jab it now. You make these wiggy woggy, like wiggy woggy, wiggy woggy. 
Wiggy Woggy. Okay, come and have a look at my Wiggy Woggy. See? I'm gonna have to put this in the oven, guys. You and me. We're putting this in the oven for 180, probably 20 to 25 minutes, and then that will cook everything down here and nicely brown on the top. So this is what it looks like, guys. The pie and the mashed potato. There. So I'm putting this now in the oven. Right in the middle. And I'll see you later when it's cooked. Cook. have it guys still bubbling away all cooked everything down here is cooked so that's why even though you had the prawns and fish in there raw it still um, had time to cook while it was in the oven so that's it here guys fish pie I'll have to let it cool down completely before I dish some out so what do you guys think yeah no maybe but give it a try if you want otherwise bon appetit fast way for guys thanks for hanging out with me you guys are awesome take care and God bless Mwah.